Hello my beautiful language learners and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to make an exercise on possessive adjectives. So in the description box you can read um, how you, um, what are the possessive adjectives and what is the difference between the masculine, the feminine, singular and plural. I would like you to have a look, try to memorize them and we're going to try to have an interactive exercise together. So, uh, I would like to introduce, along with the notion of the possessive, possessive adjectives, also some vocabulary. So, um, the purpose is to make this more um, fun and to uh, enjoy more. So, for example, I am going to say uh, the name of uh, some piece of clothing and I'm going to say it, that you have to decide if it's his or hers or yours or theirs and so you can uh, pause the video and then you can put it play and I will give you the correct answer. So let's get started. So this is a Maya t-shirt and I want you to think about her t-shirt. How would I say that in Italian? You can pause it here and I will give the answer later. So the solution is la sua maglia. That's because la maglia is feminine. Um, da, now uh, I want to say um, his shirt. La camicia is shirt. So we know that it's feminine and even if it's his, it stays the same, stays the same. La sua camicia. What if I want to say um, uh, our sweaters? Our sweaters. So, uh, sweater is la filpa. The plural is le filpe. So, how would I say our sweater? So, our sweaters? Le nostre filpe. Our sweaters. Uh, what if I want to say um, il mio pigiama, my PJ. Uh, I just, I just said il mio pigiama. Il mio pigiama, okay, it's my pigiama. But what if I want to say your pigiama? Il pigiama is masculine. Therefore, it will be il tuo pigiama. Um, now, I want you to think about um, your um, shoes, but your the plural form. So, shoes is le scarpe, and as you know from the article, it's feminine and it's plural, so it's going to be your shoes. Le vostre scarpe. Le vostre scarpe, your shoes. Um, stivali, stivali is boots, gli stivali. So, you know that it's plural and it's masculine. So, how would I say my boots? I miei stivali. Um, mm, her skirt. Skirt is gonna. Gonna skirt. And it's feminine. La gonna. So her skirt will be la sua gonna. Um, mm, mm, how about um, our bikini? Bikini is costume, but you can also say bikini. Everyone would understand. Our bikini. Um, il costume, it's masculine, so it would be il nostro costume. Now something plural, I want to say my socks. Socks is calzini, and it's plural and it's masculine. So how would I say my socks? I miei calzini. Um, mm, slippers, um, I want to say it's um, my slippers are different than yours. So, um, slippers is pantofole and it's feminine and it's plural. 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 <laughs> so I would say le mie pantofole sono diverse dalle tue, both feminine and both plurals. If you're not familiar with the notion of singular and plural and with articles, I will put the uh, link of the videos where I explain that in the description box. Um, how do I say um, his, uh, his hat? So his hat, hat is cappello and it's masculine and it's singular. Il cappello. Hence, I would say il suo cappello. 
and something for the winter. I want to say my scarf. Scarf is sharpa, sharpa, and is la sharpa, feminine, feminine and singular. I would say la mia sharpa. But if I want to say your scarves. So I want it plural. Sharpa is a singular. Sharpe is the plural. And if I want to say your scarves, I would say le tue sharpe. So that was just a very quick exercise, and I hope I, I had it was clear how I combined the vocabulary and the possessive adjectives. Um, so bear in mind that the most important thing not to get lost is to know the article. Once you know the article, you will know if the noun is plural, is singular and masculine or is feminine. And once you have that, it's easier to understand if it's mio or mia, miei or mia. So have a look and then pause me before I give the solution and enjoy it. If you have any question or if anything is not clear, please write it in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Bye!